Well, Samantha Pin, bienvenue, welcome. Sasha is a master at mixing furniture of different eras, and I can't wait to see his client space. Do I talk the talk and walk the walk? Yeah. Interior designer Sasha Jasipovich is larger than life in terms of his personality. Look at that view. Well, that was the idea, instant gratification. But also his approach to decorating and design. Because that's what we really, really needed when you walk into the room, that the view takes your breath away. I, I just, yeah, my heart just skipped a beat. Thank I you, think. thank you. Okay, let's start in the dining room. Okay. Look at that light fixture. That is killer. Thank you, Sam. Yeah. It's very interesting. It reminds me of Alien X. Mass. Alien so, X? Yes. <laughs> they look like, but it is designed from 1920s from France. Can blown glass. I really, really like the three-dimensional look and that they're moving and that they have different heights and everything was just perfect for this huge open concept apartment. And that was the inspiration for the rest that evolved here. So you didn't really steal eggs from aliens? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> The okay. table just followed up as an inspiration from these fabulous chairs that are designed by Gio Ponti, Italian designer from 1950s. Yeah. They were discovered in Brazil. Wow. And then the table just followed. It was locally designed by my company, so it's not original. Right. I'm not calling it knockoff. It's brand new. <laughs> but it's brand new, and again, it has a beautiful, very soft knife edges, and it complements the rest of the room very well. Mm. So, black table, these gorgeous chairs that are sort of the heroes, and then this carpet. Total departure. It was just yeah. a color that captivated me that had something that was very mystical. And it comes from some Persian castle or somewhere, some old Persian home just from 1800s. Just some old Persian castle. And it's worn out and it has flaws. And it, it was just something that talked to me. We thought it would be a very good addition right. or a, a horizontal surface where we can start bringing something more contemporary. Right. So it's a little bit of rough with all of the glamour. Sasha's dining room draws from a mix of design periods, creating a layered and harmonious mix of old and new. Okay, and the living room, this is incredible. So oh, wait, wait, let me open the door for you. I have to be a gentleman. Please welcome me. Welcome to my open concept space. This is incredible. I feel like I'm in the sky with all of these soft neutrals. It's kind of like you're in a cloud. I've noticed right away that you have two different types of wood and you have a number of different wood pieces. Most designers, they say don't mix too many, but I mean, this is an incredible mix of wood. Well, I'm very glad that you're saying there's only two different woods because you're forgetting about the floor. Oh. That means that I did my job very well. You see? Thank you. Oh, it's uh, just, it's seamless. Absolutely. This was our starting point. With the uh, herringbone? Correct. With the old traditional French herringbone. So this is... Ebony in, Macassar, okay, yes. Ebony Macassar. And then it is like a jewelry box where you've got the fireplace. That's, that's chrome? That's actually shiny steel. Shiny steel. Yes, yes. So this is another mix of periods. This, I relate to them as a Michelin man couches. <laughs> uh, and again, everything is about pairing. Right. That we have two couches, one is a day bed, the other one is a three-seater. Right. Then you pair down with the two armchairs, okay. again French, with something very exquisite, different and African inspired, which are the two tables. Again, a different wood, but complementary to the vertical surfaces and horizontal surfaces. Okay. Almost like an Armani. I see myself or, hanging out here. Or anytime. <laughs> uh, and they are buttery soft. Buttery soft oh. and a beautiful Venetian mist color right. that is being again repetitiously brought into on the carpet and on a couple of pieces, including the curtains. Everything works together, right? It's and softness. I... It's softness of the material, softness of the colors. So tell me about the sectional. Again, of the same era as most of the pieces, very French, 1930s. Okay. Was again positioned not to interfere height-wise, the spectacular views in the background. Mm -hmm. And uh, this sofa is more than meets the eye. Yes. Peek and see what's there. French are the best. They are true to themselves. They still make furniture with a pull-out ashtrays. <laughs> but, but no one smokes anymore. No, but you can keep your bonbons or something inside. Oh, yes. And then on the Definitely other side the here, you can have your little extension as well, where you can have your little martini. That's for my champagne, Sasha. Absolutely, and then you can see around what French again invented was this phenomenal wrapped around library, so that the view is always inspiring. I get it. I mean, you want to have everything look great from all angles, right? Absolutely. Sasha's formula for creating this stunning layered mix is a unified color palette throughout the space, which acts as a foundation for the bold mix of design periods. A mix that's truly inspiring. 
I love this space. Thank I you. think it's breathtaking. Thank you. I'm going to be inspired, especially by all of your soft gray pieces. I'm going to bring that into the space I'm designing. That's the biggest compliment you can give me. Thank you. Thank Let's you. go get a glass of champagne. Let's go. OK. Look at that lady. I kind of do look like her. You're better looking. <laughs> Sasha's breathtaking downtown condo with its unique elegant dining room space has inspired me to